India's men's badminton team wins Thomas Cup title for first time ever with stunning 3-0 win over powerhouse Indonesia in final. Brimming with confidence, India took on 14-time winners Indonesia in the final of the Thomas Cup in Bangkok and lifted the title defeating the defending champions by 3-0. Hailing the Indian men's badminton team for winning the Thomas Cup for the first time 1965 Asian Championships winner Dinesh Khanna said that the winning the Thomas Cup is huge. Oh, absolutely fantastic. Uh, there's no doubt about it. And uh, winning the Thomas Cup uh, is the ultimate as far as uh, sport or badminton is concerned. As we all know that this is the world championship team, world team championship for men. And uh, to win that is any country's dream. And there are only five countries who have been able to win it till date. And we become the sixth country and beating Indonesia in the finals, who have been 14 times uh, uh, Thomas Cup champions. I think it's absolutely fantastic achievement. So... No, we have been uh, doing well. Our individual, individually, our players have been doing well, like uh, you said, uh, uh, Prakash Padukone, uh, Balela Gopichan, and thereafter, Saina Nawal has done uh, uh, ex exceedingly well, and PV Sindhu went one better, winning the World Championship. But as a team, we have never been that successful. And our best, uh, in fact, 43 years ago in the Thomas Cup was a semi final berth. So, winning the Thomas Cup is huge because that shows that you have matured as a team. It is, it is a performance across all men players uh, and all events. So that means you have the depth as far as your uh, singles is concerned, your doubles is concerned, and you have players of the highest caliber in uh, both the uh, events, uh, singles as well as doubles. Doubles has uh, basically been our weak link, uh, but uh, this time it is the doubles who really played a critical and a crucial role apart from, of course, the singles players who played their role uh, exceedingly well. So I think it has been a team effort all through. Uh, we won the singles, we won the doubles, and that's how uh, we are there. Well, he's uh, been, uh, he has uh, uh, given uh, a kind of warning that he was getting back to his form when he won a silver medal in the World Championship, uh, I think five or six months ago. So that was a very, very uh, positive sign. Uh, then we had Lakshya Sen who won a bronze medal in the World Championship and uh, HS Pranoy reaching the quarterfinals. So that was a big indicator that our boys are doing exceedingly well in singles. Now our doubles combination of Satvik Sai Raj and uh, 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 Chirag Shetty have also been doing well in the Super Series. Some of the other, they have been losing some matches, very close matches to the top pairs. Probably it seemed that they were lacking somewhere in slight kind of a confidence. But this time, they proved that, uh, you know, they, they played with a lot of self-confidence because that's so very important when it comes to close matches, when it comes to such crucial matches and particularly in team ties. So I think uh, it was a combined effort of our uh, uh, singles players and HS Pranoy, of course, uh, also played a very critical role in our earlier matches uh, uh, against Malaysia, against uh, all our players, Srikanth, uh, Lakshya Sen, uh, our doubles pairs, uh, Chirag uh, Shetty and uh, Lakshya Sen, uh, sorry, Chirag Shetty and uh, Ranika Reddy. So I think, uh, I mean, there's no doubt that it has been a team effort uh, which has gone into winning this cup. No, I would say that uh, our players uh, for the finals, after having beaten Malaysia, who are uh, a number of times Thomas Cup winner in the quarterfinals, and then getting the better of Denmark again by a margin of 3-2, which was a very close tie, who have also won the Thomas Cup, uh, uh, you know, earlier. Uh, so that gave them a lot of confidence. So our boys seem to be really motivated and inspired going into, th into this uh, tie against uh, Indonesia. And uh, as we saw, Lakshya Sen played a critical role. In fact, he was uh, ousted in the first game rather easily, mm -hmm. but he bounced back in the next two. And uh, uh, he got a very, very valuable point for us because the first point uh, is always very encouraging for any team. And uh, thereafter, it was followed by our uh, doubles pair, uh, Chirag uh, Shetty and uh, uh, Ranika Reddy and who played, I think, uh, exceedingly well. In fact, they had lost the first game, 
they were down 17, 20. In fact, match, they were down 17 match point. Uh, the, we would have lost that point. But they were uh, absolutely looking still confident and inspired and fighting back. And uh, they uh, won the second game and the match and giving us a most valuable point. And Sirikant, of course, has been in excellent form. He played uh, Jonathan Christie. Uh, as we, if we see, in fact, all the players who played, uh, the first three players, uh, they were, uh, the Indonesians are much higher ranked than our players. Uh, uh, you, uh, Ginting uh, was, uh, is ranked number five, as against Lakshya Sen's number nine. Uh, our Chirag Shetty is way down as compared to the pair who was, of course, broken, the Indonesian that broken the pair. And they had one player from their number one, world number one pair, and one player from number two pair. I do not know why they broke that combination. Probably his regular partner was uh, ill or something or injured. And uh, uh, the, the, the third single also, uh, Jonathan Christie, who ha who's the uh, current Asian Games gold medalist, he is also ranked uh, much higher than uh, uh, K. Sirikant. But our boys really played an inspired game. And uh, Sirikant, uh, of course, as I said, has been in excellent form of late. And uh, he's a delightful player to watch. In fact, he's got a very smooth flowing strokes. And he's got an, a great attack. You know, when he attacks, the opponent is not able to judge where he's really going to place the shuttle. And he's got some fantastic stroke, great net play. And he outmaneuvered uh, Jonathan Christie. Uh, you know, last time uh, Indonesia uh, won the critical point through Jonathan Christie. So I think Sirikant winning that point was very, very uh, critical. I think it was overall absolutely fantastic achievement meeting the uh, Thomas Cup uh, uh, champions 3-0. Uh, you know, as I said that uh, earlier doubles has been our weak link, uh, but this time, and uh, uh, I, I, now the reason for that is that uh, I would say that uh, uh, there has been a big government support. There has been, uh, as far as finances are concerned, uh, because if you want to perform well, you need the best coaches to train you and be with you. If you only have second-rate coaches, then the results will also be according to that. Uh, so we had uh, uh, earlier, uh, uh, when when uh, our uh, double Chirag Shetty and uh, mm -mm, Satvik Sairaj or Renika Reddy, that pair was coming up. We had the Indonesian coach, we had the Korean coach for some time. And now we have the Danish co uh, coach, uh, Matthias Bo, who has been one of the world's top players. So, you know, at that level, sometimes uh, small things make a big difference. So it is the fine tuning which is very necessary. That what kind of a stroke, what kind of strategy you should adopt, and the uh, player of that level uh, giving tips, not only tips, and training them in a proper manner, uh, you know, before a tournament or during the camps. So we have had uh, uh, regular camps in the uh, Prela Gopichand Academy. Of course, is the national academy. We also have Prakash Padukone Academy from where Lakshya Sen uh, comes. So these two academies have done a uh, great job as far as uh, honing the skills of the players is concerned. So I would say that uh, uh, it has been a fantastic effort of all agencies also put together, of the government, of the association, of these academies, the coaches, the trainers, and the players themselves. Because you have to, when you're playing at that level, you have to sacrifice a lot. Uh, you have to train hard. You have to, in fact, there is the results that we see here there is a hard grind behind that, you know, through which the players have gone. They have to sacrifice some of their social commitments, social life uh, to an extent. They have to, in fact, sometimes the training is to the point of punishing yourself. So you have to have that determination, that grip, that discipline in you, which is so very important, you know, for a player to reach that level. And that uh, passion, passion to do well, that burning desire that, uh, you know, as some people would say, fire in the belly. You know, so so I think uh, that has been there, and this training, the international exposure, the funding by the government, uh, our coaches, you know, uh, honing their skills, giving them, uh, training them uh, on the proper lines, giving them all the kind of support which is required. I think that is what has made the difference, and today we have seen the results. Uh, as I said earlier. 
that uh, uh, you know we had we had very tough uh, match against uh, Malaysia, who have also been uh, champions number of times. So obviously uh, we won three two against them. So last match uh, again it went to the fifth match, which was which was played by H S Pranoy, and H S Pranoy is a very solid player. You know he's got good temperament. And uh, he has a, a, a very a nerve, a strong nerve. So, which is very important, uh, particularly in team matches, and when you are playing a deciding match. So, anyway, our doubles combination beat the Malaysian combination, who was ranked, ranked, uh, ranked higher than us. Of course, Lakshya Sen lost his match to Li Ji Za, but that is okay because, as I said, it's a team effort. Some player may lose, but then the others have to support. So, I think winning that match against Malaysia. And then winning the match against Denmark, who again have been Thomas Cup champions, and again our doubles played a very first doubles played a very vital role. And we knew that our second doubles, we may not be able to take out that point. So we had to basically depend on four points: the three singles and one doubles. So which was very crucial. So it was very crucial that out of the first three matches against Indonesia, we had to win the first two matches to stay in contention for the title. Because if we lost two matches in the first three, then we lose the uh, second doubles and we are out three three one. So the the first the uh, Lakshya Sen uh, winning the first point uh, was very important. Although he had lost the first game, but I could see that even after win, uh, losing the first game, of course he was playing with the drift where he found it difficult to control his strokes and shots because sometimes when you are playing with the drift and these big holes you can't avoid that uh, it becomes a problem uh, but the, in the second game uh, he came bouncing back uh, so strongly and he took the second and the third game and the game he played it didn't seem that he was under too much of pressure he was inspired and i must uh, give credit to the coaches who had gone with them of course bimal kumar is a very experienced coach he is the chief coach in prakash padukone academy uh, so he was there and i am sure his presence itself would have been a very very uh, uh, big support uh, for lakshya sen and he must have uh, told him that you have to keep your cool you have to play with confidence because confidence and your nerve play a very important role when it comes to a team tie like this which is such an important and a historic event particularly for india who are in that position for the first time